The smallest satellite ever launched by NASA has been made by an Indian. Yes, you heard it right. And today, in a little more about, we will talk about Rifat Shah Rukh, the man behind this innovation. At the time of its launch in 2017, when Rifat Shah Rukh designed and built the satellite, he was just 18 years old. He named the satellite Kalamsat after late President EPJ Abdul Kalam. The tiny satellite weighs around 64 grams and looks like a tiny Rubik's cube sans all the colors. That's the equivalent of around 5 tablespoons of sugar. Rifat Shah Rukh designed the structure of this satellite completely with 3D printed and reinforced carbon fiber polymer. According to Rifat, it is for the first time that 3D printing technology is being used in space. The 3.8 cm cube structured satellite can fit in one's palm. It is equipped with a nano Geiger Muller counter for measuring the radiation in space. The satellite gets separated from the rocket 125 minutes after it takes off. Dr. Srimati Kesan, founder and CEO of Space Kids India, was tasked with supervising the entire project. The project got selected through a competition named Cubes in Space, which was sponsored jointly by NASA and iDoodle Learning. The competition was all about creating an experimental satellite that would fit in a 4-meter cube and also possess an accurate mass of 64 grams which can be sent to space. According to Rifat and I quote, the main role of the satellite will be to demonstrate the performance of 3D printed carbon fiber. We designed it completely from scratch. It will have a new kind of onboard computer and eight indigenous built-in sensors to measure acceleration, rotation and the magnetosphere of the Earth. The main challenge was to design an experiment to be flown to space that would fit into a 4-meter cube weighing 64 grams. We obtained some of the components from abroad and some are indigenous. This achievement is certainly something to make us feel extremely proud. Giving kids the wings to fly will allow more kids to join into space missions not just in India but across the globe. We have some idea about space but a lot of it still remains a mystery. With each satellite being sent out, space agencies are able to collect more data, analyze and evaluate them and we are in a much better position to understand space. That apart, such launches really does boost the morale of kids. They have a fresh mindset and look for new opportunities. Propelling their imagination from a very young age has its own merits and all parents must encourage their kids to imagine as big as possible. Because of Rifat's work, in 2019, ISRO opened its space program account with Kalamsat, a small communication satellite developed by students from Space Kids India. It was the first time that ISRO was launching a student-made satellite that's about a 10 cm cube with a lifespan of 2 months. It weighs 1.2 kgs and was built at a cost of 12 lakh rupees. Rifat's work has proven that if you work hard and are consistent, space is just the beginning. The story is to inspire all of you out there. No matter what age you are, remember you are capable and your dreams matter. So go out there and do whatever you want to do and if you're not launching a satellite, you can launch your own dreams in a big way. Do share your thoughts and keep watching this space for more such content.